Formula One race car drivers live their lives at 200 miles per hour. It's their job to fly around tracks all over the world in vehicles so fast they need to pilot them. But what do they do in their downtime? How do they spend all those millions of dollars, pounds, and euros they earn racing? Do you know which driver has a car that can go up to 300 miles per hour? Or how about who has the best yacht? So let's get into pole position and wait for the green flag as we answer how the richest F1 drivers spend their money. Lewis Hamilton is arguably the greatest F1 driver to ever live. The British-born Mercedes AMG team driver has won seven championships, over 100 race wins, and 192 podiums. All that winning has netted him over $50 million per year and a whopping $285 million net worth. Lewis Hamilton has endorsement deals with companies like Monster Energy, Tommy Hilfiger, Bose, Puma, and numerous others. He's basically the face of F1 racing. And being the face of the motorsport, it makes sense that he's spent some of his immense wealth on an incredible car collection. Mr. Hamilton has a McLaren P1 worth over $1.1 million and a top speed of 217 miles per hour. Lewis owns two Ferraris as well, including a $1.4 million Ferrari LaFerrari, a car so rare the car company chooses who is allowed to own one. Speaking of rare cars, he owns an extremely rare 1967 Shelby Cobra 427 worth approximately $2.4 million. But the McLaren, the Ferraris, and the Shelby pale in comparison to the jewel of Mr. Hamilton's collection, the $2.7 million Mercedes AMG 1. The AMG 1 is such a gorgeous, fast, and responsive vehicle that it boosted video game sales of the racing game Forza Horizons 5. It's fitting for the Formula One champion Lewis Hamilton to have some of the finest cars known to man. But where does he spend his time when he's not behind the wheel? Well, he's got some fine options of places to lay his head, one of which being his mansion in London, England. His six-bedroom, two-bathroom, 5,628-square-foot detached villa has four floors, a summer house, and of course, a huge driveway. This property set the driver back a cool $18 million. But when he's not there, you might find him crashing at his condo in Monaco worth 15 million bucks, which is ironically a modest price and property for the neighborhood it's in. In addition to that, Lewis also has a penthouse in New York City and a suncatcher yacht worth almost $4 million. How does he get to all these places? First class is a good option, but when you're this successful on the track, the sky's the limit. Which is exactly why Lewis Hamilton has his own private jet. In 2013, he bought a 10-passenger Bombardier private jet for $23 million. However, he received a $4 million rebate on it, making the net cost around $17.3 million. Lewis gave his jet a red and black color scheme, a few interior alterations, and has been flying the friendly skies in style ever since. Max Verstappen is the youngest Formula One driver to ever win a race, which he achieved at age 18. Now 25, this Belgian-Dutch racer for Red Bull has won two championships, 39 wins, and 83 podiums in his young career. So what does a young, successful racer spend all that money on? Right after Max turned 18, he moved down to Monaco and started renting a $16 million condo with a view of the Mediterranean. He turned his balcony into a gym and can be seen jogging around the neighborhood. Max also has a bevy of beautiful European cars in his collection. His first car was a gift from his parents, a yellow Renault Clio worth between $13,000 and $24,000. His first purchase back in 2015 of his own was a Renault RS01, which retails for around $400,000. He then followed that up with a Porsche 911 GT3 RS worth about the same price, a gift to himself after his first win in 2016. He also has had four Aston Martins, including a DB11, the street-legal version of the DB10, famously driven by James Bond, Inspector. That set him back about 205 k He then bought a 2018 Vantage for about 150000 an Aston Martin V12 Superleggera worth 360000 but his finest ride has to be the Valkyrie Hypercar. This metal and glass masterpiece is an Aston Martin Red Bull collaboration and has an insane top speed of 250 miles per hour and a $2.7 million price tag. Altogether, Max's collection rounds out to about $6.4 million. 
Max enjoys speed on more than just the open road. Taking advantage of his seaside residence, he enjoys ripping around on the waves on his custom Red Bull jet ski, costing somewhere between six and $20,000. And in his home, he has a sim racer that apparently only he is allowed to go anywhere near. His one-of-a-kind high-end simulation machine consists of a PlaySeat F1 Ultimate cockpit, a custom-made LM Pro steering wheel, Heusenkfeld Ultimate pedals, and a Leo Bodnar sim steering system. The entire set cost him between $15,000 and $35,000. Speed on land, speed at sea, virtual speed, what else is there for him to go fast in? The only dimension that's left is the air, and Max flies in comfort on his Virgin Galactic Dassault Falcon 900EX private jet. It's reported that this particular jet belonged to Richard Branson himself. The EX version is the long-range variant, which is necessary for F1 drivers' transatlantic flights. Max has given his jet a custom paint job, complete with his own logo and the flag of the Netherlands on the tailwing. The upkeep alone costs more than a million dollars per year, and overall the plane is worth about 15 million bucks. Lastly, he's an animal lover. In 2021, Max welcomed two new pets into his home, Bengal cats, that are among the most expensive breeds in the world. Each cat usually costs anywhere from $1,500 to $3,000, and that's not including food and vet bills. Charles Leclerc is another 25-year-old racing phenom with five race wins, 25 podiums, and 19 poles out of 108 starts. This rising racing star has been behind the wheel since he was eight, in go-karts of course. Going pro at age 19, Leclerc has been living the dream for six seasons and counting. And since he's raking in a cool 12 million bucks a year, I don't think he wants to wake up. It should come as no surprise that Leclerc has a pricey car collection of his own. As a driver for Ferrari, that seems to be his car of choice. Charles Leclerc is the proud owner of a blue Ferrari GT C4 Lusso, a black 812 Superfast, and his very own customized 388 Pista Spider, complete with a red and white Monaco flag racing stripe down the middle. That custom Pista alone cost him a million bucks, but the piece de resistance of his collection has to be his Bugatti Chiron, which is named after Louis Chiron, a former F1 driver who happens to be Monegasque as well. This high-powered rocket ship of a car can reach a top speed of 304 miles per hour. For perspective, a 747 takes off around 184 miles per hour. Rounding out Leclerc's car collection are a few British cars to offset his Italian choices, a McLaren GT worth over 200k and a Rolls-Royce Wraith worth 300,000 for when he wants to ride a little slower, but with a lot more pizzazz. In fact, Charles probably uses the Wraith to take him down to the docks to spend some time with his other vehicle, his luxurious yacht. Now, Mr. Leclerc used to own a 15-meter, four-person, 48 Dolce Riva yacht, which he named Monza after his first Grand Prix win, worth over two million bucks. He has since upgraded to a Riva Sportfly 66 Rebel yacht. This beautiful boat boasts three cabins, a room for its ship's crew, and four bathrooms. He named this yacht Sedici, which is Italian for his race number 16, and it's priced at $3.5 million before upgrades. As a young Formula One driver, Charles Leclerc is constantly traveling and constantly moving fast. Every second matters. And sometimes you're moving around so much it's hard to keep your time zone straight. Well, Charles Leclerc has found a fashionable way to solve this problem with his luxurious collection of exclusive watches. He's been seen wearing Hublot timepieces that can cost up to $52,000. But the Monegasque is a huge fan of Richard Mill. He owns an RM6101 Ultimate Edition watch worth around 775 k and an RM3502 worth 125 k That's over $900,000 on just two watches in his collection. But that's not all. Recently, Charles has been spotted sporting an RM3503 automatic Rafael Nadal worth up to $200,000, and he's also been promoting a limited edition RM UP0 Ferrari watch worth almost $2 million. That is a lot of money to spend on telling the time. And unfortunately, his watch collection took a loss. In April of last year, his RM6702 Charles Leclerc prototype watch was stolen in Italy. That particular watch is worth $320,000, but has raised as much as $2.1 million at auction. 
when he's not ripping up the French Riviera in one of his many supercars or ogling his expensive timepieces, Charles Leclerc spends time on some pretty expensive hobbies. Like his fellow driver and Monaco neighbor, Max Verstappen, Leclerc has shelled out some major coin on a virtual racing setup. But unlike his Dutch counterpart, Leclerc set up two virtual racing stations in his villa. Both include a play seat cockpit, Fanatec podium racing wheel, and Club Sport Pedals V3. Throw in a bunch of Samsung ultra-wide monitors, and you have about $16,000 in simulation racing hardware. During the pandemic, Charles Leclerc said he played more guitar and piano since he had the time. So he bought himself a white Steinway & Sons upright piano, which retails around $47,000. And once he buys a bigger home, he intends to upgrade to a grand piano, which can reach prices of up to $200,000. The son of legendary off-road racer and two-time rally champion Carlos Sr., Carlos Sanz Jr. decided to keep his speed on the track and away from the dirt. The 28-year-old Spanish racing prodigy has one win, 15 podiums, and three pole positions so far. Last year, Carlos earned $9 million in salary and another $15 million in bonuses. Carlos seems to have similar tastes to his fellow drivers. He has a collection of supercars, including a McLaren 720S that can go from 0 to 60 in 2.9 seconds, and a Ferrari 812 Superfast that boasts over 800 horsepower. He has an extensive watch collection, including a Richard Mille worth over 120 k Carlos enjoys some downtime on the golf links, and while he's out there, he swings with his own custom Hanma brand golf clubs worth over a thousand bucks a set. His team, Scuderia Ferrari, appreciates their drivers, Carlos and Charles Leclerc. So much, in fact, that the team bought the drivers' homes in Maraneo, Italy, near the racing team HQ. But Carlos Jr. bought Carlos Sr. a modular home right next to his, so they can each see each other more often. Jr. is even a shareholder of the Aciona Sons XE team, a team that competes in races involving electric SUVs in some of the most remote parts of the world that have been affected by climate change in an effort to generate social awareness. It also happens to be where his father still competes in rally racing. Driving Formula One cars is a unique and exhilarating experience, and based on how these F1 phenoms spend their time and money, their downtime is just as exciting. From sports cars to million-dollar properties and yachts, these speed demons really have it made. Thank you all for watching. Please be sure to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more content right here on The Richest.